Hello guys, welcome back. And in this video today, I'm going to show you how to fix without that redemption exited unexpectedly and error code access violation C00005 in your PC. So let's get started. Solution number one go to your documents and go to Rockstar Games folder and go to your Red Dead Redemption folder and go to settings and open this file system.xml file right click on it and open with notepad and scroll down and search for advanced graphics and type here Vulkan instead of uh, direct td12 uh, type here Vulkan and go to file and save close it solution number two if you're still facing the issue then go to this pc and go to local disk c and go to user folder and go to username go to app data view and show hidden items go to app data and local and go to d3d sketch and delete this folder from there hit delete okay now go to this pc again and go to documents and go to rockstar games folder and that the redemption folder settings and open with notepad search for advanced graphic settings here and uh, type here d3 12 and go to file and save and okay close it and if you're still facing the issue then make sure you have uh, uh, graphics card supported 12 uh, directx 12 supported card go to search bar on your windows type here dxt iag press enter or go to run command click here and go to display if you have multiple gpus then uh, i have another solution of this problem go to display so you can see uh, already installed uh, running in the background graphics card uh, in the windows you can see so my graphics card sports uh, feature level 12 and drag 3d 12. you can see guys so i can fix my issue for my this game if your car is very low and not spotted DirectX 12, then you can use another solution of this problem. So, but first is right click on your computer screen, go to display settings and uh, scroll down and go to desktop app. Uh, yep, graphic settings and click here at desktop app and go to the folder so this is my folder for that that redemption and select this launcher play earlier and go to your launcher so my launcher is here on my desktop add and select another app this one add and select all launcher add now search for all application for that that redemption click here and select from here high performance okay now scroll down search for other application click here and uh, select from here high performance scroll down again and this one and select from here high performance okay now it's done now close it and go to your launcher right click and play the game so if you're still facing the issue then go to properties and compatibility uncheck this option uh, this one and check this option okay and check this option hit apply and okay and launch your game if you're still facing the issue then you'll need to update drivers with clean installation so these are my new drivers right click on it and run as administrator now check this option and agree continue and custom advanced next and check this option perform a clean installation check it and click on next 
So after installation uh, of the latest drivers with clean installation, you can fix the issue. If you're still facing the issue, then I have another solution. Uh, go to control panel and go to category, click here and go to uninstall program and search for Microsoft Visual C++ 2008 64-bit and 86. So you need to update this version of Microsoft Visual C++. Right click on it. If you don't have this version, then you need to install it first. So uninstall and uninstall this one and search for 22, 2015 and 22. And close it and also this one. Now reinstall this version of Microsoft Visual C. Now these are new Visual C. Open this folder and this one 2008 64 bit. Right click and run as administrator 2008 next and install and finish. Now try this one, next, and install, finish. Now go to 64-bit, 2022, 64-bit, and install. Close it, and 86, and OK, close it. Now go to Control Panel, Uninstall Program, scroll down. So you can see already installed. So if you don't have this version, uh, 2012 and 13, so you can install this version if you're still facing the issue. And make sure you have already installed DirectX 11 and 12 in your Windows. Go to search bar in Windows, type here DXTIAG, press enter, or go to run command. So you can see, already installed DirectX version in your Windows. So I have DirectX 12. So make sure you have DirectX 12 already installed in the Windows. If you're still facing the issue, then you'll need some DLL files for D3, D12. Go to the file and right click on it and extract with Windrar, extract two, and this one, wkd 3 d and DXVK. Right click on it and Windrar Extract 2. Now go to this one DXVK 64. So you need this file. Go to your game directory. Open it. You can see this is my RDR and this one DXGI and click here because I have already this file. Now go to D312, we can D3D, open it, and 64. So you need this one, D3D12. And okay, play the game and enjoy without the error. And I hope this tutorial helps you and please subscribe to the channel and uh, thanks for watching. Bye-bye guys.